Thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord, everybody. We're going to get started. <clears throat> I know you're fellowshipping. But let me say this. I want to thank everybody that donated anything for the uh, community day. We had such a variety of stuff. And I think we served, what was it I said? It was 36 family plus some here, 40 some people. And they were blessed. We had all kinds of stuff to get. We sent a van load of stuff to Pierce Ministry. So thank you for caring and helping serve this community that came out and blessed their life and blessed their homes. We had a family with seven, with five kids that came out and the church was able to bless them with clothes, food, toiletries, and all that. So thank you for that. I appreciate that. Praise the Lord. Let's everybody stand. The person beside of you, just tell them welcome. We're going to pray first over this offering. Thank you, Jesus. How many's got needs by an uplifted hand? Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. God knows your needs. When you pray, believe. Amen. I thank you for being here. I thank God for our online family. I, most of all, I thank him for his presence. I want us to pray before we receive an offering. And I want everybody to pray with me. Thank God for our visitors that's here this morning. Thank God for those that's been coming back in now that's been sick. I praise the Lord. Won't we give God a great big hand clap of love? Praise the Lord. Lord, we thank you this morning for everyone that's walked through that door. We thank you, Lord, for those that we had the opportunity to meet yesterday, Lord, and you blessed their life with things that these people provided. I thank you, Lord, this morning, those that lifted their hands. Lord, let their prayers go before you like a memorial. I thank you for visiting this service in a special way. Help your people to praise you and lift you up, the things that they have on their heart. If they'll just give it to you, believe, Lord, the answer will be on its way. I thank you because you first loved us and looked beyond our faults and just saw our needs. 
thank you for being in our midst tonight. Bless those that give to build the kingdom of God here, Lord. I thank you for what you're going to do in this service. I thank you for what you've already done. I thank you, Lord, for the miracles that you did for people's lives this week, Lord. We give you glory and honor. We ask it all in the name of Jesus. And everybody said, praise the Lord. Go ahead, ushers. Help me sing this little chorus. It's old. They that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. Oh, they shall mount up on wings as an eagle. They shall run and not be weary. Oh, they shall walk and not grow faint. Well, teach me, Lord, teach me, Lord, my God. Everybody helping me. Well, they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up on wings as an eagle. Well, they shall run and not be weary. Well, they shall walk and not grow faint. So we're in the house of the Lord. He deserves to be praised. So I want you, before we start singing, 
to give God your best praise. I don't know if it's a hallelujah. I don't know if it's a shout. I don't know if it's a clap. But he deserves to be praised. Come on. Thank you, Lord. I'll praise in the valley. Praise on the mountain.
trophy to make you proud. I'll never be more loved than I am right now. Going through a storm, but I won't go down. I hear your voice carried in the rhythm of the wind to call me out. You would cross an ocean so I wouldn't drown. You've never been closer than you are right now. Cause you are a child.
does he love you? How much more does he love you? How much more does he love you? It's more than you ask, think, or imagine. According to his power working in us, it's more than enough. It's more than enough. It's more than enough. You are Jaira. You are enough. Jaira. You are enough. And I will be content in every circumstance. You are Jaira. You are enough. Can we proclaim that to the Lord again? Jaira. You are enough. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Jaira. You are enough, and I will be content in every circumstance. You are Jaira, you are enough. Somebody needs to be reminded that God is for you and that he's going to provide. Jaira, you are enough. Sing it together, voices lifted. Jaira, you are enough, and I will be content in every circumstance. You are Jaira, you are enough. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus.
today. He's chased you down your whole life. But today, ask the Lord to open your eyes. Ask the Lord to reveal his plans for you because I promise that they are good and not to harm you, to give you a hope and a future. You're not overlooked. You're not unseen. You are seen by a sovereign God 
who cares more about you than you can even imagine. With no shadow you won't light up, mountain you won't climb up, coming after me. With no wall you won't kick down, lie you won't tear down, coming after me. No shadow you won't light up, mountain you won't climb up, coming out to me. Oh, you won't get down, oh, you won't tear down, coming out to me. There's no shadow you won't light up, mountain you won't climb up, coming out. The wall you won't kick down, the lie you won't tear down, coming out to me.
ਜਦੋਂ ਮੋਸਾ ਅੰਦਰ ਦਰੇ ਕੇ ਦਰੇ 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 ਕੇ Oh, don't you get shy on me. 
be lifted up your song. Cause you got a lion inside of those lungs. Get up and praise the Lord. Hey. your inadequacies he already knew you're enough your praise is enough he's got you he's got you he's got you and I know people think oh she's talking to one person Mm -mm. there's multiple people in here you come in here Sunday after Sunday you put on the happy face friend he's got you you are enough there's nothing you can do to manipulate his favor you've already got it but sometimes we have to wait but the wait is worth it the blessings that he has for you for a 
to listen for his voice. Thank you, Lord, for your peace, your comfort. Thank you, Lord, for the reminder of how you love us, that you're our Jireh and that you're going to provide, that you're our joy that you're all that we need. And when we try to strive to earn your goodness or to earn your favor, to earn your love even, that you remind us you're not that kind of God, that you loved us even before we could love you or even love ourselves. We've had your love since day one. It's your good pleasure to take care of your children. So why would we worry? Why would we fear? When the God of all creation has our back, that he knows us by name, that he even knows the number of hair on our head, that anything that concerns us concerns him, and that if we'll listen to his voice, if we'll be still and listen, if we will lay our pride to the side, he will direct each and every one of our steps. It's not his will that we should falter or stumble. He's got us. And he'll lead us. And if we just stay yoked up to him, his burden is light. It's not his will for you to go through trauma and trouble. But if you do, he'll be right there with you. Because he never leaves us. He never forsakes us. Even when we've gotten out of his, his will. Even when we've messed up. He's just a prayer away. A whisper away. 
Today, God's got you. You. His love for you is stronger than you can imagine. So why would you worry? If you don't know him, if there's distance in your relationship with him, there's no condemnation here today. All I know is that the spirit is drawing. He's drawing his people, people who haven't accepted him yet. I don't know, but he's drawing. God, we thank you for your goodness. We thank you for your love. We thank you that you chase down imperfect people who have been in places that are dark and it doesn't phase you, it doesn't change your mind. You still love us. You're a good, good father. And we are a grateful people today. Obviously, service is different. If you feel like you need to be at the altar for anything, please come. Nobody's going to look at you funny. We're all trying to get closer to the Lord. Valley 
to know there's no fear that I have. He doesn't already know there's no problem too big. There's no weapon too strong. There is nothing for God that's impossible. There's no mountain too high, no valley too low. There's no fear that I have. He doesn't already know. There's no problem too big. There's no weapon too strong. There is nothing for God that's impossible. You're all we want. 
make you feel the room. You're here and I know you are moving. I'm here and I know you will feel me come now. Spirit, when you move, you make my heart melt. When you feel the room, you're here and
My Lord, what a presence in the room today. What a presence in the room today. Somebody say, well, ain't nobody preach. If you missed this message, you missed it all. You missed what it's all about. The preacher showed up today. I've seen people stand up and mess services like this up. I refuse to get in his way. So if you missed the message today, what you missed was a God who loves you recklessly. What you miss is a God who wants to perform the miracle that you're looking for. What you miss is a God who wants you to worship him in spirit and in truth. What you miss was a prayer answering God. I want to tell you today that we do serve a mighty miracle working God who loves you in spite. Not because how good you are, but in spite in spite of myself, he loves me. In spite of me, he loves me. I'm talking about a God who doesn't talk about your past. He's not even really worried about your present. He wants to show you your future. And your future starts today. Your future starts today. Your answer starts today. Your miracle starts today. Oh, Lord, so here's what I want to do. They're going to play another song. This is not scripted, I promise you. This is not scripted. They're going to play another song. And as they play this song, I want everybody in the room to get back into your spirit of worship and if the Lord's leading you to this altar whatever the reason may be maybe you're here and you need to re-experience that reckless love maybe you're here and you need a healing in your body maybe you need restoration whatever your need is my God is here to perform that need my God is here to answer your prayer so as they're playing this song I'm going to invite you if you've got a need in the house today the altar's open if you want us to pray with you we'll pray with you but I want everybody to worship the Lord and just follow his lead we're not going to drag this out they're going to sing a song and we're going to open the altar and we're going to believe that God's going to answer prayers today. God's going to show himself with miracle signs and wonders. If it's a fresh fire you need, my God's here to give it. If it's a healing you need, my God's here to give it. If it's a bridge that you need rebuilt, my God's here to build it. If you need to restore your relationship with the Lord, my God's here for restoration. But he's here for you. So let's worship today. This altar's open. strong and I've been broken within a moment I've been faithful and I've been reckless at every bend I've held everything together and watched the shatter I've stood tall and I have crumbled in the same breath I have wrestled and I have trembled toward surrender. Just my heart had dripped and drifted home again. From the blessing to life and desperate to find redemption. And every time I turn around, Lord, you're still there. I was found before I was lost. I was yours before I was not. It's grace to spare for all my Your glory needs my praises. But if this borrowed breath is yours, Lord, take it all. You are faithful and you are gracious, and I'm just grateful. I think that you don't need a single thing, it's still you want my heart. I was found. Before I was lost, I was yours. Before I was not, you wear the scar for all my mistakes, and that part just wrecks me. Oh, I. I don't deserve 
Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. He's too good, isn't he? Somebody say amen. He's too good, isn't he? I don't deserve it, but he freely offers it to me. I'm so thankful for the grace and the mercy, the healing, the promises of our God, the promises of our provider. I'm so thankful to be a part of a busy body. Somebody say amen on that one. I'm so thankful to be a part of a busy body. We got so much going on, church. Um, just a, a few things. Thursday. Somebody say Thursday. Thursday. No, 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 no. You didn't say right. Say Thursday. Thursday. Hey, there it is. Thursday is the last day to order shirts and hats. So please, 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 if you want a shirt, New Day shirt, or a hat, the New Day leather patch hats, they're going to be in black, gray, and white, and the purple. And then the shirts are in honey and red. Please see Jordan. She's going to be at the Welcome Center on your way out. So if you need help ordering one, you'd like to order one, have questions about them, please find her. Thursday is the last day to order those. If you haven't been able to tell, we got a baptism tonight. Somebody say amen on right there. Amen. Baptism tonight. Please come back. 6 p.m. We do baptisms just a little bit different around here. Just a little bit different around here. So please come back. Be a part of that. 6 p.m. tonight, we're going to have a joint baptism with the Matters of the Heart Life Ministry where more than 20 people have signed up to profess Christ as Lord and Savior of their lives. God is moving. He is moving today just as he moved then. He is a powerful God. He is a mighty God. I'm so excited for the service tonight. If you are going to get baptized... Please be back here at 5.15 for a meeting with Pastor John. 
Um, if you are going to get spontaneously baptized, that has happened before. The only thing it costs you is a wet ride home. So you're good to go. All right. Um, continuing on. Tuesday, Echo Extra. So this Tuesday is Echo Extra, our young adults uh, ministry. We have Echo Group. We're going to do an extra night. It's going to be a night of fun. Um, if you'd like to come join us on our Echo Extra, please meet in the uh, young adult Sunday school room. Got some information to give you on that one. Uh, that's right after service. So, again, join us this Wednesday, 7 p.m. Brother Steve Puckett. Brother, raise your hand right there. That's Brother Steve right there. He's going to be delivering a powerful message. He's got a word to deliver to us. So I can't wait for that one. That's Wednesday at 7 p.m. And then the Carowinds Trip sign-up is on the app. So the Youth Carowinds Trip sign-up, it is on the app. Please go to registrations. Find that for all the information you can register on there. I have... Heard it said, I believe uh, Charles Spurgeon said, that roller coasters increase prayer life. I think that's what he said. Uh, so, so please join us, church. We are so busy. We have got so much going on. This body just loves to get together, and, and it is fantastic. It is fun. And uh, I love each and every single one of you. Um, I'm going to ask uh, Brother Avery if he will dismiss us from this service. Thank you, Lord, for allowing everybody to be here today and uh, be with us as we come to this 